Hej. Hej ja. Good morning, welcome to the channel. Today's video is going to be a bit of a unique situation because usually I'm the one going away, but Chanel's gone away. Chanel has gone to the tour. As you probably know, Chanel is supported by Skoda, and in turn, Chanel supports the Skoda DSi Academy. And part of that involved going and watching the first uh, Tour de France Femmes, which is presented by Zwift, and oh dear, <laughs> and, uh, and also the men's, men's tour. So I'm for a couple of days, and this is the third day, Chanel is back this afternoon. Well, it's me and Juliet, and I have to train as well. So I thought I'd run you through what that looks like. It's organized chaos. I think first is like Chanel's made it as easy as possible because, well, just with the food side of things, a lot of that was pre-prepared. Pre -prepared. So I haven't had to leave the house unless it's us going for activities. Hi. Hiya. <laughs> So, this is my alarm clock to start each day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my alarm clock. Today was today was pretty. The last couple of days have been on the six something. She, she, Juliet's a pretty good sleeper. She's a pretty good sleeper. She's got a little bit of a cough at the moment as well. This morning we're up at quarter past seven. It's I don't know what time. It is nine o'clock now. So we've been playing Lego. We've been chasing Albert. We've been coughing. And we've been sending some passive aggressive hints to me that we want to go out involving getting Juliet gets her shoes and asks them that they're put on and then gets my shoes and puts them at my feet. So we're gonna go out, gotta get some a few bits as well. I'll take you along for the ride. Gonna go get a coffee. We're gonna go to the park, aren't we? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah? Okay. Yeah, that way, that's where we're going. Out. So we're, we're gonna go for a coffee, go to the park, take your bike, and then we're gonna quickly go to the shops to get some bin bags, because that's our situation currently. And a cat on the table, because Juliet likes sweetest food. Yeah, this, oh, this. Yeah. yeah, they're not the best of friends right now. Well, Juliet loves Albert. Albert doesn't reciprocate that, so. Anyway, we're gonna go out and take you along for the road. You look like an intrepid explorer. Ready to go? Yeah. Go to the park? <laughs> Come on, up the stairs. Ah. Uh, you can do it. So, finished at the park, done the supermarket shop, and I'm gonna jump back in the car and go back home where we'll just while away the time until the midday nap, which is where I go training. We're already rubbing eyes, which is a, it's not, not a good sign, because it's still a bit early. Juliet's roughly two hour midday nap is training time for me. On the turbo, obviously, with the monitor in front of me. Not doing volume at the moment, uh, but very effective. 2040s today. 
who one thing I've found with these days is I can quite easily lose track of my own nutrition just a snack at what she doesn't eat yeah so today just making sure I'm, I'm on top of it I haven't felt depleted on the bike at all which is good because back at altitude so there's an extra strain on my body I just need to yeah so just cooking myself up an omelet on toast and maybe a bit of cereal before today's session had a good good dinner last night Juliet's tucking into an omelet as well. Then we're not a million miles off of training. Um, it's just before 11, so she'll be going down pretty pretty soon in, a, in an hour and a bit. Trick for me is to be on the bike as quick as possible the minute her head hits the pillow. Last two days I've had to split the session into two because she's woken up before the end of it. I'm trying to aim for that to not happen today. Can I have my knife? Thanks. Thanks. I'm gonna play with your Lego. I'm gonna go for a nap. Right, training setup. Excuse the light, that's uh, more of a stand than a light at the moment. iPad for Stranger Things, fan for coolness, various battery packs, an elite Doretto trainer, Factor Hanzo, five spoke front wheel, towel. Fires Club towel and the session is all uploaded, ready to go. Now it's time, ah, oh, and hammerhead. Now it's time to just fill the bottles whilst getting Juliet down and then get going real quick. Yeah, as quick as possible. And I'll have her monitor in sight as well in case she wakes up. Just a bit of a pre, pre break, done two sets of intervals, one more. What we're doing today is, yeah, like I said, 20 40s, 15 45s, and 10 50s. Now, that kind of thing, that's an easy session to get through, except when the off isn't that off. The off is at like 290, which up here is, is quite uncom is, is uncomfortable. Um, and the on is uh, 390 for the first. 20 for the second and as close to 500 as they can get for the third so it's quite grippy three top blocks of 10 minutes yeah just finished just finishing stranger things and has anyone noticed how jason in it who's chrissy's boyfriend who's trying to seek vengeance throughout the whole of the four latest series looks very much like jasper phillipson very much like him i'm gonna put a picture in just here there's a picture of them both Never seen them both in the same room. I mean, Jasper's won two stages of the tour, so I figured his work's been cut out with training for that. But if Jason played a cyclist in a film, Jasper could be the cycling stunt double. Littland's still asleep. So unlike the last two days, I should be able to get this finished before she wakes up. But that means I need to stop talking and continue training. We're done. We are done. We go. feel pretty good. We've got Tora Poland next. Um, first race since, if you don't include <coughs> the Nationals, it's my first race since the Giro. So it's been a while, probably a bit rusty. Gonna take a little bit of getting into it. Did a couple of TTs. Poland has a TT, which I was excited about until I saw it wasn't a TT. Well, it is a TT, but it is more of a hill climb than a TT. Honestly, with the exception of Torino, I've done precisely zero TTs this year that have suited me. It doesn't look like there's going to be any either. I'm hoping to go to the Tour of Denmark, um, but it's not on the schedule at the moment. Nothing in the Tour of Britain, but I think I will be finishing off with Corona Donations, which is a race that I've uh, done in the past, which I really enjoy. Um, I think that'll be my final race this year, so that's something. That's something, but yeah. Juliet's still asleep, so I might have a bit of me time. And we're awake. Good morning. All right, Grump. <laughs> Big nap. The last two days I haven't been able to finish my session because of uh, Juliet waking up. But today, God, 
almost could have done a full blown endurance ride. Big three hour nap, but sorted the house a little bit fast while she was asleep. Now she's off to terrorize. Here we go. Gentle, gentle. Lunch for me today is soup and a bagel. I think I'll be on an easier day tomorrow. I think, I hope. So yeah, just keeping it light, because I'm not overweight, but I'm not, um, you know, I'm, yeah, I'm just a little bit above race weight, so but rest days can really pack it on um, if we don't get it right. So just gotta keep a lid on things, you know? Let's round this video off. I mean, it hasn't been a full day, honestly. The rest of this day involves keeping, keeping Juliet alive and suitably entertained. Yeah, the last couple of days we've gone to the local swimming pool because it's been hot, it's not, so we'll, we'll chill out. She'll go to sleep around seven. Now, if I've got more time to make up on the bike, which I don't today, um, I will then jump back on the bike. I've done some eight till 9 p.m. turbo sessions, which takes some motivation to like start. But once I'm doing it, and then once I've done it, I'm glad I've done it. And that's, that's the way I often try and approach training, especially when the motivation's real low, is, is I think ahead. I'm like, how am I gonna feel if I don't do this? And the answer is usually pretty rotten, so that serves as my motivation to, to do it. Yeah, and then dinner. Just downloaded the F1 2022 game for PS5. I'm on a controller, not the steering wheel at the moment, so it's not quite the same, but still seems to be pretty, pretty cool. I think she's doing a poo. I think we've got a code brown. Yeah, that's number three today. <sighs> Juliet. So I might do that dinner bed. <laughs> Thanks for watching, see you next time. <laughs>